Well, Old Spanish Days opens with Fiesta Bikini on Wednesday night at the Old Santa Barbara Mission. As News Channel reporter Tracy Lair shows us, that's where organizers plan to make an announcement tomorrow morning. Things can change in an instant when it comes to COVID and Old Spanish Days. Santa Barbara County Public Health issued a statement saying, Given our very high local transmission rate of the virus in the community, we do strongly advise that all participants in the Fiesta activities wear masks in indoor and outdoor settings. Anybody with a weakened immune system or a frail general health should not participate in public festivities. Anyone with even minor cold symptoms should stay home and not participate. At a private fiesta-themed event where the spirit and junior spirit danced, we asked this year's La Presidenta what she wants people to know. What we want them to know is Old Spanish Days and myself, La Presidenta, we are um, committed to having a safe fiesta, no matter what our fiesta week looks like. Um, we are taking everything, all the precautions that the health department has given to us. The Mercado de la Guerra has already been canceled, but there will be food at Our Lady of Guadalupe, the church fiesta canceled last summer will be a smaller event Friday through Sunday with mass required. We took a large, large hit. We, we really, this is our event that, that sustains us throughout the year. So um, it's really important for us to have this event, but we just want to make sure that safety comes first. Old Spanish Days plans to hold a news conference on Tuesday at 1130 a.m. at the Mission to update Fiesta fans. In Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter Tracy Lair.